Hi guys, I'm Josh. And I'm Isaiah. And, and today, today we're viewing Planet Base. <laughs> Welcome to Bros Review. I love science fiction. Books, movies, video games, you name it. And I was feeling a lack of science fiction in my life a couple weeks ago. So I researched a bunch of games on Steam and came across Planet Base. It looked really cool, so I bought it. Josh and I tried it out and we loved it so much, we decided to make this video to show you guys how great this game really is. Planet Base is this super awesome game where you're put on different planets and you have to create a huge colony that's self-sufficient. Some of the things you have to provide your colonists with are food, water, oxygen, places to sleep, and just like you and I, they need entertainment. This game has you constantly building things to keep your colonists safe as well as to continue the growth and development of your base. There are four planets for you to colonize in this game, each one having its own set of challenges, anything from solar flares to sandstorms. When you first begin, you will only have one planet available to you. When you start, you will have nine colonists, two robots, and one ship full of limited supplies. From here, you're going to have to grow your colony. And one of the best ways to do that is to produce your two main components, which is bioplastics and metals. You need these to create more structures. There are 10 challenges for each planet. Once you've completed these challenges, you will then unlock the next planet. If you notice, Josh mentioned robots. Yes, there's robots in this game, just like little wallies. They help your colonists so they don't overwork themselves and get grumpy. The game makers also added an interesting twist to this game. There are traders, colonists, and visitors. Traders will trade goods and money for items that you need. Colonists will come stay at your base permanently, and visitors will pay to stay overnight. This adds a new challenge because some people come armed and dangerous, so make sure you got guards on duty. We learned so much from this game that we were inspired to start our own colony on the planet Earth. I really like this game and I think that the gameplay is well thought out and it never gets easy. You always have to keep an eye on your vital supplies. The only thing I don't like about this game is that expansion can seem a little slow at first, but it speeds up pretty quick. Like Josh said, this game keeps you on your toes. You can't just walk away from your keyboard and hope things keep going smoothly. You always have to keep an eye on everything, which makes it really entertaining and makes it so you play for like hours at a time, which is really fun. The only thing is, I don't think this is an evergreen game. After colonizing the four planets, I think I'll be done with the game. Whereas other games like Minecraft and Rocket League kind of encourage longer gameplay for months or years. This is a great game if you want to test out your strategy skills and experience a little sci-fi. And while there's a lot to keep your eye on and learn, I think that most people are able to pick this game up fairly easy. Remember to come back next Monday when we review something new. And remember to like and subscribe to keep up to date on all our latest content. We hope this review helped. Thanks, guys. Later. <laughs> Oxygen. That's what I forget. I this game continually has... Continually? <laughs> I meant to say constantly. <laughs> continually. No. I think continually is a word. I don't know. I just say constantly. I'm, I'm going to look it up just because I want to okay. know. Look it up. Continuously is a word. Continually is not a word. Mm -hmm. No. <laughs> <laughs> I can already tell that's gonna be bad. <laughs> like a toddler. I just know when you're gonna do something. <laughs> Step colonists into your base to get more workers to help expand. <laughs> I don't know. I'm trying to figure out how to game. After harvesting harvesting the planets. After <laughs> harvesting the four planets, I have no need for the rest.